Hi, I'm Kevin Craver, senior reporter for the Northwest Herald. This week is Sunshine Week. It's a week-long observance by newspapers to show you, the public, the importance of Freedom of Information and Open Meetings Acts. A lot of people don't realize just how easy it is to ask taxing bodies for public information because it's your information, your tax dollars paid for it. So today, here at McHenry Public Library, we're going to show you how easy it is to file a Freedom of Information Act request. I had a request from the, a relative from Florida. She, all we have is a simple newspaper article that says he was, the home was broken into and he was uh, injured and later on, a few days later, he died. And today we're trying to find a location of a crime and what happened in the 1970s. And we're going to try the Freedom of Information Act to see if we can get that information from the McHenry County Sheriff's Department. You want any reports dealing with this man's, uh, uh, the, the crime committed against this fellow here. Okay. And it looks like it was the Sheriff's Department that did it? Yes. Okay. Typically, you always want to start out with directing who it is now. I know for a fact that uh, Jan Weech, that's her name, is the FOI officer for the Sheriff's Office. So you always start out with who you always want to name on there. And then you're always going to want to say regarding so they know exactly what it is. A lot of people don't realize that, that this is their information to have. They pay for it with their tax dollars. A lot of, there's a lot of information in this world that the state agencies are required by law to give. So, first sentence, this is a request for information. Let me ask you this. Do you want copies of the documents or do you want to go in and see them? A copy would be fine. Documents be provided to me. Let's say any documents regarding a crime committed. Do you know what day he was found? He was found uh, the day on the December, early morning hours of Monday, December 4th, 1972. 1972 at 3207 North and the address here. The key when filling out an FOI is to be, sometimes you want to be general, sometimes you want to be a specific. In your case, the more specific you are, the easier it's going to be for them to find it. But now they know this guy's name, where he lived, where the crime occurred, and the day. So that should be pretty simple, okay? Now what's going to be interesting is, so we're going to ask the sheriff's office for uh, the essentially the incident report, you know, the, the first observation and then yes. any documents regarding the investigation into the crime. Monday. Let's ask him if anyone got arrested. Any, any Find out whether arrest. it was solved or not. Yeah. You typically want to give them, if this is going to cost more than a certain amount of money, call me first. For, for future reference or those of you watching at home, here's the deal. A government is only allowed to charge you a per page copying fee or if you get it electronically, a scanning fee, okay? So like you charge, I don't know, 10, 15 cents a page here or something like that. They, for example, if they get back to you or any government saying, you know, these 10 pages are 10 cents a piece, but it took us two hours to find them and we had to hire an attorney to make sure, so that's a $100 search fee, they can't do that. The only thing the government can charge you for is the cost to reproduce the documents. When a government agency gets a Freedom of Information Act request, they have seven working days to respond to it. And they can say, Here's your information, it's ready for you. It can say we need, because this is an older record, they may say we need an additional seven days because it's in some dusty box in the back and we have to find it. That's allowed under the law. Or they can deny the request based on, but they have to cite in the Freedom of Information Act why they're exempting it. Sincerely, your name. All right. Looks good to me. On your assignment, just mail that off, and, uh, okay, and we'll, we'll see today. what happens. Hey, it's been a pleasure. Thank, Thank you, you very much. much. No Appreciate problem. It. Tell me how it turns out. I will.